The final race of the day is back at Cheltenham and it's the Presbury Park Hurdle. It's a Presbury Park Juvenile Hurdle. It's a Grade 2. So just for four year olds at the top, Treble Spark, David Robertson, Devon Dumpling for Derek Hinton. You're going to like it, Joshua Sutherland. Corson's Pride, Martin Leadham. Duo Trapani, Darren Thompson flirting around Leon Van Rensburg. Polar Link and Royal Pawn for Craig Beckwith. So just eight. And this is the only four year old race this week, so I wonder where all the four year olds are. And away and racing, there's two four year old races at the Cheltenham Festival, remember. And if we've only got a dozen or so to go between the two, it's going to be a bit weird. But anyway, they race down towards the first of eight. And over it they go. And Polar Link is over it in the lead. I don't think anybody's double handed at this point. Craig Beckwith has got two in it, so. He's got two four-year-olds at least. Well, I've got two. If it was one of the four-year-old running another hurdle race, which was a mistake because the four-year-olds just don't compete against the older horses in SO7 the way they used to in SO6 as they get down to the second. I'm very surprised if you get a four-year-old winning an open race. Not a race for five-year-olds at all. Anyway, flirting around is in the lead as they pass the winning post and go out for a complete circuit. Some of them might be dabbling in a national flat race, but there's a national flat race at Cheltenham as well. So, whether people look at the Cheltenham races when they're making their teams, I don't know. Maybe some people are going to bring some in in the window. They've left some space in their stable. I don't know. But anyway, we'll see. I still think there's potentially an argument for increasing the numbers in the break by maybe five. But some people may not like that. As they get over the third. And here towards the next, I'm just speaking totally from a commentator's point of view. And it's far more interesting commentators on these races if there are plenty of runners. Anyway, flirting around is a good five or six lengths clear of Devon Dumplin in second. Or Derek Hinton as they get over the fourth. And Treble Spark and Duo Trapani. Polar Link is next. Dell's Double. This is what we were talking about earlier. Or well, the Dell's Double race is tomorrow. It's the Max and Gold Cup. And basically, the biggest handicap in real racing terms is the way we're going to do it on the flat and the jumps. Each week, as they get to the fifth, which they all get over, you will be asked to pick a tri cast the first three. And anybody who gets, a, gets it right in both races will be an absolute genius and we'll win a prize to go to charity. That's the way it's going to work. This week is the Victoria Cup on a flat, which I think is tomorrow, and the Max and Gold Cup, which I know is tomorrow. Anyway, he's flirting around in the lead as they come down towards the third lap. Flirting around lands in front. Treble Spark is second. Duo Trapani is third. Then you're going to like it after that. Devon Dumplin, then Royal Pawn, Polar Link. Corsten's pride isn't going at all today. And he's out of the back when it's flirting around. Who's got the lead from Treble Spark in second? This is the second last. Over it they go. And flirting around now being chased by Treble Spark. You're going to like it. He's trying to run around the third. Then Devon Dumplin, Duo Trapani trying to get into it. Polar Link, Corsten's pride, Royal Pawn. They swing for home with only a furl to go, and there's only one more flight to take, and it's flirting around, and Treble Spark, who come down to it in the lead. They get over it nicely, they're over it safely, they're being chased by Joe Trapani, you're going to like it, Devon Dumplin, they're racing inside the final half furl, towards the next going to be another one for Leon flirting around, and takes it. Treble Spark, you're going to like it, might be in third, and... Corson's pride was last, I think, a big disappointment on that one, and... Flirting around the winner for Leon van Rensburg, Treble Spark for David Robertson was second. Joe Trapani, Darren Thompson third. You're going to like it, Joshua Sutherland fourth. And Devon Dumpling for Derek Hinton was fifth. Actually, day one, hopefully my voice will be okay for Maccas and Gold Cup Day tomorrow. <laughs>